Welcome back to Good Day Stateland. We are in Byron again with the Byron Fire Department and Chief DeMick continuing uh, with this house that we, we left it here. It's still here. It's still here. <laughs> it's still here. And we're going to do something with it today. Yeah, we're going to go over advancing an initial attack line. Uh, essentially, there are three strategies. We have an offensive interior attack. We have a defensive exterior attack, or what's called a transitional attack. That would be if we had a heavy fire situation on the one floor, we would pull a large caliber attack line to dark down, dark it down the flame front put a smaller line on and move inside. All of our hoses on our engines are all pre-connected, so we, we can go inside for anything from, again, large, fast spreading fires to smaller interior attack. Going into this particular situation, what we're gonna do is simulate that we may have a, a bedroom fire on the second floor, and we're gonna take the show through the mechanics of advancing the hose line. So, are you ready? I am ready. Here we go. All right, at this point in the segment, what you're gonna see is Michelle here is gonna take a hold of the hose line. She's gonna bring it up the stairs. She's gonna to turn to the left. She's gonna open the nozzle. She's gonna knock down the fire that's in here. And then she's gonna go over the window, simulate some ventilation. I mean, that's what we're gonna see next. Michelle, are you ready? Yes. Come on, dear, let's make it happen. Okay, work the line left to right. Work it all the way around. Get the ceiling real good. All over, get the ceiling. There you go. Beautiful. Okay, set it down. Put it underneath your arm. There you go. Yeah. Nice. There you go. Tight. Right. Yep. Okay. I improved a lot that time. <laughs> You having fun? I'm exhausted. Oh. <laughs> so there you have it. How'd you like that? This is very hard work, which I assumed, but you know, it now you be, try it, you're like, okay. It can be very demanding. Now the next part that we would get into, and we'd uh, send members in with pipe poles, we would pull all the ceilings down, open up the walls, look around the casing, look for hidden fire. So then we'd have to conduct some more searches. So there's a lot more to it after the fire's out. I imagine so, yeah. Indeed. All right, so very tough job. Uh-huh, very physically demanding. Yes, but you are looking for new members of the fire department. We are looking for new members, uh, so uh, look us up at joinbyronfire.com. See if we can bring you on board. We have so much more on the way with the Byron Fire Department the rest of this year. You're, you're going to love it. Coming up next, opening day, game day with the Beloit Skycarp. Don't go anywhere.